It's Gamescom time, baby! Right then chat, we've arrived at Manchester Airport and it's about 10.30 a.m. today. This is basically like a small part of um, Manchester Airport. I'll show you, I'll show you, hold on. Right here, we're flying with Ryanair today. So yeah, this is Terminal 3. Um, it's a smaller part of Manchester Airport. It's where we book in to fly to places like Germany and Spain, basically just the closest, um, the closest countries to us. So yeah, right, we've dropped the bag off now. So I'm heading for the departures area and I'm gonna go through the security, which is gonna be really, really annoying because every time I travel, you guys are seeing all the stuff that I've got in my backpack, so I've gotta empty all of that. Literally, all my cameras, all my mics, um, webcams and whatnot. And we've literally gotta spend like 15 minutes when I get, I've gotta queue up for like 20 minutes to get to the actual security part, and then I've gotta empty my bag as well. And then I'm gonna put it all back in. Um, I don't think I'm allowed to film in here, so, um, we're just gonna have to cut it off there and uh, hope for the best. Right then, took me about 20 minutes to go through that security place only because it wasn't actually my electronics. My electronics were absolutely fine. It was my toothpaste. I had a toothpaste in my toiletries pack, right? And I forgot to take it out. We're gonna go and grab breakfast now and I'm gonna show you guys what Manchester Airport is like. Right, we got, we got a menu here, chat. You know what, let's, let's just stand here and see what we can get. Um, I, might, I might just have an English breakfast, chat, so you guys can see what what an English breakfast is like. Right, we're gonna get an English breakfast and a pint of whatever the heck they are. Hello, can I order? Yeah. yeah? Can I get a full English breakfast, please? Can I get a pint of San Miguel? Do you have a table? No. Uh, I'll, 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 I'll sit on one of those, yeah, yeah with the plugs. Oh yeah? We'll sit together, then you'll be in my video. <laughs> right and chat, we got our pint. Got a pint over here. Pint at what time is it? It's 11 a.m. Oh, it's not too bad. 11 a.m. Right? I don't. I don't feel too bad. I don't feel too bad for having a pint at 11 a.m. But this is our full English breakfast chat. We get. We get the nice sausage. We get. I, I think this is. I think this is potatoes. Yeah, that's potatoes. Potato bites. Um, this is not actually a traditional full English breakfast, so I kind of let you guys down on this. But look, I'm really hungry, so I'm just gonna tuck in. Right, cheeky pint done at the pub, full English breakfast done, I am hella full, I'm actually quite tipsy because I hadn't eaten anything in the morning and I banged the pint out already. My gate is at number 56, it's literally, I think it's boarding in, in like in the next 10 minutes so we're just gonna go there and chill and then we're just gonna enjoy the 1 hour and 30 minute flight to Germany and we head straight to the hotel. All right, en route, Germany, Gamescom for Arena Breakout part two, baby. We're just about to board the plane right now. I had to wait literally 20 minutes, sat down while everyone boards the plane on the priority pass situation. So this is what, what the outside of the airport looks like in the UK. Hopefully, I'm boarding the right plane. I don't really know what seat I'm in. Um, I need to get my boarding pass out again. My boarding pass is on my phone, so I'm gonna have to, uh, I'm gonna have to switch off guys, see you guys in a sec. Right gang, my taxi's here. We ordered a premium, premium ride because you know, Arena Breakout sells us out with all the vouchers and whatnot. There he is, right, he's right there. My guy is right there, bro. Yeah, that's him. That's my private chauffeur for the day, baby. <laughs> Tesla, let's go. All right, all right, I, I gotta hop over. Can I hop over here, yeah? Yeah, hold on. I'm gonna hop over, chat.
<laughs> Here we go, yeah. We had to just we had to just bomb it over there with some heavy shit on my back. Lovely, I was gonna jump it but I thought nah. Yeah. It was too heavy, the bag the bag was too heavy on the back, but right, here we go. Got a nice premium Tesla babies, nice leg room. Um Folero Hotel. Right, we've arrived at a hotel gang. I'm gonna go check in now. Filero Hotel in Germany, very, very close to Gamescom area, um, Gamescom location. I'm gonna need to keep it a little bit low. I'm probably gonna need my phone because all my information is on my phone, so catch you in a sec. Right, got my room number. Um, I'm, in a, I'm sharing a room with a guy called Velion or Velion. Velion, we'll find out in a sec. But he's a Tarkov creator. I'm gonna be going up to my room now. I'm gonna knock, but I don't really want to just barge in with a camera, so we're, we're gonna make sure that he's prepared, you know what I'm saying? It's not like butt naked or something. All right, where are we? Um... Oh, I don't think he's in, I don't think he's here yet. I don't think he's in chat. I think he's out. Yeah, I think he's out, right, he's not here yet. But we got our uh, we got our own little humble abode here, chat. Got our own humble abode situation. I'm guessing he's taking camp over there. So this is gonna be my banger of a bed right here. This is the view. Ooh, lovely, lovely paradise. I wonder how far it is from the um, from the venue. But yeah, I'm gonna go get settled down, and then I'm gonna go set up here on this table here because I need to record a few gameplay um, for some sponsored videos and then edit and stuff. So. Gonna be one hell of a day. Gonna be hell of a one busy day, guys. But yeah, I'm gonna go do some work and then I'm gonna relax later on, wake up early, fresh in the morning, and then Gamescom time, baby. Right chat, we've just gone into another location. Apparently we're shooting some, I don't know, what are we shooting, 10? Some cinematic stuff? I'm gonna be an action man, hero. I'm gonna be the main boss of Arena Breakout Hello. Infinite. What's, what's going on? Yeah chat, so basically we've gone into another location now. We've just done the, the media first impressions, early access. Like I said, I have no idea what we're gonna film, but they want us to act. I haven't really charged them extra fee for the acting, but I'll give it to them for free. It's all good. So it's all a part of the part of the club, innit? But yeah, here we go, chat. Oh, oh I think they're gonna dress us up military style. God damn. Hello. Hello. Hi. Oh, look at that, chat. We got a T6 rig right here, armored rig. Oh, Lord of mercy. Everybody's waiting for you. Oh, every, all right, everyone's waiting for us. I better go, chat, eh? Better go. Right, chat, so they got me changing into this um, into, into this T-shirt where I'm, I've got like blood all over me. So basically, I've got to be acting right now. We're going to be doing some Oscar-winning performance where I wake up, apparently I'm injured. And I'm like, oh, yo, what's going on? And then homeboy Valiant kicks in like, yo, I got your stuff. I got you back. I don't really know what's happening. They're going to give us the dialogue soon, but I'm just going to get my hair and makeup done. <sighs> so I can look good while I do my Oscar winning performance. Over here is the makeup station. Hello, all right, let me set up in the back. <laughs> here we go, uh, should, I, should I, am I gonna be sitting there? Yes. All right, here we go. Right, Jack got my makeup done. I had to get out because they're actually filming in there right now. Three, two, one, action. I can't obviously be in there if I'm going to be vlogging like this because they're going to hear me on mic and things, right? But what do we reckon, chat? What do we reckon to the fit? We're all like, we're all like injured and things, bro. But why do I got to be the dead guy? Bro, why do, 
Why do I gotta be the guy who's been knocked down and getting rescued? Like, yo, I'm like the number one back to back to back rich or die champion, three times with Kiwi Delta and King, second place land tournament winner in China in front of 5,000 people, and then in the next in the next China land tournament in front of 10 million 10 million people, man. Like, why why have I got to be the guy who's dead? Why have I gotta be the guy who's gonna get knocked? You know, picked up after being knocked. Anyway, chat, yo, what boy we reckon to the fit though? What we reckon to the fit though? They're gonna need me in the filming there now, so I'm gonna show you guys what's actually being filmed, but we gotta be quiet because they are in literally in the middle of filming right now, I think. I'm not quite sure what I have to do. Apparently he has to bust through the door and then pick me up, something like that. But yeah, we'll go and find out in a sec. Right then gang, let me tell you what happens in Gamescom, how everything works, what you can expect from it, what you can see, basically the whole shebang. I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys, A, have never been to Gamescom before and B, don't even know what actually goes on in here. So let me give you guys a private tour. This obviously started off with a reader breakout. We've got a whole ass, Oh, last booth over here, right here. I don't even know where, it's not even called a booth anymore. It's literally a freaking arena chat. And then right over there, which is the main stage, is level infinite, right there. So obviously like arena break out here, there's other games around here, but don't worry guys. Like I said, I'm gonna give you guys a full tour. Let's go and check out arena breakout infinite first. So we've got a queue over here, it's actually day one. So what happens is, I think it's, it spans for like five days, I believe, or four, three multiple days anyway. Today is like the first time it's been open to the public. So there's not that many people um, in the whole event yet, but there's no, it, like the, the event normally gets sold out. I think like the second or third day, something like that. But people queue up here and then they all wait to take turns to get inside the booth right here. So they've all got to wait here and it's lovely that gentleman lets them all in and gets them a, a play test in the, in the PCs. Look at all these Alienware PCs, baby. God damn. Um, these are basically the streamer PCs, so um, some of the streamers or like demonstrators play on here and then they all get played on a big screen. And what happened is everyone basically gets to play test the global version of the game and right at the start of the morning, they were briefed on like when it's going to come out, what to expect, Q&A, blah, 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 from the head of Morphon Studios, Enzo. And um, that's already finished. I'll show you guys a video of that when I'm actually allowed to. But here we go. Here we go, baby. And then we got some of the arena breakout stuff in here. We got some of the event stuff in here. Gamescom stuff right here. So basically what happens in Gamescom is they get this card, like this is an example, right? They get like a card like this. And then if they go to one of the gaming booths, they get like a stamp on their card, right? And then they get some sort of points. They get, like, there's like a point system on how many games a booth you actually visit. And then you get freebies and shit. Yeah, so this is the arena breakout booth. Let's go and check out all the booths, gang. Right gang, next one, you'll never guess what it is. Farm Simulator, baby. Woohoo, yes. This shit is a real game. Yo, this, this, I actually saw this last year and I was like, hey, yo, wait, hold up. Farm Simulator? People actually play this shit? And I was like, yo, I'm really intrigued. Look at this, look at this. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Yo, ain't no way. Yo. Movement. Oh, oh this actually looks sick though. Look at it. Yo, look at this wheel and the joystick. Yo, that's fucking mad. Oh my god, look at this tractor over here. Oh, we got some cosplayers, chat. This is another thing that you can expect in Gamescom or any gaming um, gaming conventions. I don't know what the fuck is going on here, but I'm, I'm digging it. Yo, I'm hella digging it. It's the whole level in for the stage. We got some... What's Exoborn? That's the game. I don't know what it is. Never heard of it. But I have now. Exoborn, child. Look at it. Look at all these fuck players, baby. Yeah, this is the level infinite main stage. These guys have got absolute bags, guys. It costs a lot of money to have one of these main stages. To be fair, it costs a lot of money to just have one of those um, one of those boots right there. I'm not gonna tell you how much because obviously I don't want to get in trouble, but. A lot of money chat, a lot of money. There's a lot of money that's gone into investments in this game. Yo gang, so I was obviously looking for Delta Force, right? Just to see what's going on in, but I've come across Marvel Rivals. I actually wanted to play this game because I'm a very, very 
big Marvel enthusiast. I'm not a massive Marvel head, but I just love Marvel, right? So we're gonna have a look at how it plays out. It's Marvel Rivals, Chai. It's basically Overwatch, but Marvel. Yo, chat, let me know if you want me to play this, if you want me to stream it, make content for it. Cause this looks absolutely fucking bonkers. Yeah, it's arena based shooter. It's basically Overwatch and Marvel. That's, that's, that's all you gotta know. But now let's go and find Delta Force. Right, I swear to God, I've been trying to find it for the last 15 fucking minutes. I still can't find it. I think I'm getting close though. Let's ask some people. Let's ask some people. Excuse me, do you speak English? Yeah. Um, do you know where Delta Force is? I have no idea. No idea, no problem, we'll find it. Thank you. Oh, look at that Merc, oh shit. Yo, get out of my car. Yo, why are these motherfuckers in my car, bro? Yo, get out. God, oh, chat, I found it. Chat, chat, chat. Hey, yo, we found, we found it, we found it, we found it. Yo, here we go, oh shit. Bam, Delta Force, baby. Woo! Right there, oh my god, in the flesh. Oh, look at that, bro. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, look at all them rigs, baby. All right, we're gonna try and get access. I'm gonna ask them. I'm gonna ask, oh, wait, 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 Vel! Vel! Hey! hey. My roommate, hey. let's go, bro. Am I okay to vlog inside? Uh, you can do videos inside. Is yeah. that okay, yeah? I'll Thank you very much. You. He's gonna fucking choke anyway because I'm gonna break in, you know what I'm saying? Yo, the vibes in this place is really good. Everyone's really nice. I'm like, wait. Are we, are we gonna wait? Yeah. We're fucking VIP. No, we're not. We're, we're VIP, bro. No? <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> oh, here we go, chat. Here we go. Lovely, jovely. Right then, chat, there's actually about 11 of these. There's literally 11 fucking warehouses and it's jam packed with games and there is just absolutely no way that I'm gonna be able to show you even a quarter of what they have in this place. But that's basically Gamescom chat. It's just stalls after stalls after stalls. You queue up, you get your stand, you test the game, blah, 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 and then you get some freebies and you also get to find out new information about upcoming games, current games, upcoming updates, and all exclusive access and shit. But I'm just heading into Arena Breakout Infinite booth again into the arena. And, uh, but yeah, it's been an absolutely successful day, guys. This is day one. It's about to get even more busy tomorrow and the day after that, and then the day after that until it finishes. I've heard that a couple of the days are sold out, so it's gonna get absolutely heaving in here today hope you guys enjoyed the vlog let me know what you want me to vlog next and i'll see you in the next one peace right then gang it is currently 1 30 p.m on friday um i'm at germany airport now cologne and you can see that i'm limping that i'm moving real slow right now this is because do you remember the day where i arrived at the airport and then a taxi came and then it was on the other side of the fence yeah. well I tried to bolt over that fence, didn't I? And I tried to do one of those hand on the fence thing and then jump with two legs over the fence. Now, I could have made that really easily. However, I had this, I had this massive bag on my back and it's fucking heavy, right? And then I was running to the, I was running to the, um, to the fence and then I committed to the jump and then I realized, shit, this bag is so heavy. I'm not gonna make it but I'd already committed. I was literally mid-air and then I decided to slide cancel my, my jump mid-air and then I landed like really weird on my leg like this and I twisted it on my way down. So I, I, still, I still managed to vlog though, thank God. So yeah, but now I'm definitely fucking paying the price for it and my leg is absolutely dead. But anyway, guys, it's been an absolutely amazing trip. This is like my sixth or seventh trip with Arena Breakout, I'm not too sure. I've, I've pretty much done every single one of their global trips, or one of their global campaigns, and I'm just absolutely, um, you know, I feel blessed, and I feel very appreciative of the, of the team for always flying me out to different places, and it's been an absolute blast, guys. I can't wait to show you guys what's in store. We've also filmed that crazy cinematics, which should be launching next month, 
But as soon as it's out, I'll let you guys know. I'll put it on my channel. But I've obviously got a lot of BTS in the background. So once you've seen the cinematics, we'll go over how everything was filmed, what the plans are for the game, and what my plans are for my channel, my you know games that I play and stuff like that. So enjoy the video anyway, and let me know what else you want to see from me in the future, and I'll go make that for you. Peace.